More boys basketball highlights as well as swimming coming your way on the Friends. And with a check on what else we have, we turn it over to Mark Robbins. Second ranked East Catholic hosting neighbor East Hartford at the Eagles Nest Friday night. And East Hartford with Anthony Douglas letting it fly while the visitors get going on the road. And then the Hornets defense with some stinging effort. Ezekiel Cruz with the steal. And he finds Douglas ahead for the lay-in. East Catholic is a team with a ton of talent and they're still finding ways to improve. Matt Nolan, the Yale commit, is undoubtedly this squad's leader, but others have stepped up, like 6'6 junior Brody Limerick and fellow junior Matt Hode, who's a sharpshooter from the wings. East Catholic in control of this game throughout and takes the victory, 58-39. So I got here to South Windsor a little early, and before the game, I noticed every, you know, I've been here a long time, been coming a long time, and I've seen you, Mrs. Mrs. Jordan, as the kids know her. How many, uh, since what year did you start serving pizza? Oh, 1991. 1991, and now you're a, you're a, a substitute teacher here? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. Why do you like coming here all the time? Oh, because I love the kids. You do? Yep, yeah, and go South Windsor. <laughs> all right, go South go. Windsor. The game's in there. Yeah. And it's senior night to boot. Manchester's Red Hawks were out to spoil the Bobcats' fun. Eric Burgos with a left wing three. For South Windsor, senior Trevor Anthony finds a little space on the curl into the lane and hits a 15-footer. Manchester has a lot of strength, though, on the inside. It's Isaiah Kane finishing. And then Patrick Jordan gets loose. And man, oh man, did Manchester ever get it going in this one winning 100 to 69. Hey, they were splashing around the pool in East Hartford this afternoon as East Catholic was visiting the Hornets. In the 200 medley relay, East Catholic coming up with a big victory. The team of Jack Hemingway, Drew Paver, Christian Valandry, and the anchor, Daniel Buck. Caver came back moments after that to win the 200 free. Nate Malia of East Catholic finishes first in the 200 IM, and then Malia winds up edging East Hartford's Alex DuPont to win the 50-yard freestyle. East Catholic outlasts the depth of East Hartford and gets the win, 97 to 83. I'm Mark Robbins, Channel 3, Eyewitness Sports.